Sean! 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 I've been looking for a long, long time here. Looking for a father that would be able to do what mine could not do. Sacrifice himself in order to save his son. <laughs> oh, I searched, searched, searched. And then I remembered you. All those murders, just to find a father capable of saving his son. Just to find a father? Do you have any idea how it feels to be a worthless nothing in your father's eyes? Believe me, I've suffered. Just as much as my victims. I finished her damn trials. Now give me back my son. He's there. All you have to do is open that grave. Sniper's in position? Yes, Lieutenant. They're ready on your command. Perfect. He won't get away this time. We'll gun him down as soon as he shows his face. Hey! You there! What are you doing? Lieutenant, my name is Madison Page. I'm a journalist. I have proof that Ethan Mars is innocent. He's not the origami hey, killer. What is a journalist doing here? I thought I told everybody to keep their mouths shut. Get her out of here. I don't want her getting in the way. Okay, Lieutenant. 
All right, come on. You're about to make a terrible mistake, Lieutenant. Ethan Mars is innocent. I can prove it. You were gone. Oh, Dad, I, I knew you'd come and oh. save me. Oh. Sean, listen. You are the best thing that's ever happened to me in my life. I want you to know that whatever happens, I love you more than anything in the world. I... I'm not dead. I took points an hour ago, and... and I'm not dead. <laughs> Ash, get her out of my face. Mars didn't do it, for Christ's sakes. He's innocent. Personnel, hold your fire. I repeat, hold your fire. Madison? What's going on? The cops. They're out there. They have the building surrounded. They'll shoot you if you go outside. I'll go out alone. I'll talk to them. I'll explain. You'll be dead before you can open your mouth. Look, we'll all go out together with, with our hands in the air and they can't possibly shoot us. Have the evidence that proves your innocence. Listen, I'm sorry I didn't trust you. I was only thinking about Sean, and I thought that's okay. The only thing that matters is that you saved your son.
There was general relief this morning when the police announced that they had found Sean Mars alive more than four days after his disappearance. Mars had been imprisoned in a well by the man known as the Origami Killer. The successful resolution of this case was made possible only by the bravery of Ethan Mars, who the police believed at one point to be the killer. It is no doubt due to his great courage and tenacity that he succeeded in foiling the plans of the Origami Killer. The police commissioner presented him with an official apology today. Our main headline today. It is reported that the police have identified the man thought to be the origami killer. Scott Shelby, 48, is a former police lieutenant who claimed to be a private eye hired by the families of the killer's victims. Shelby was killed during a massive police operation, but further details have not yet been released to the public. Let's just say a friend of a friend let me jump in line. If we like it, it's ours. Hey, Dad! I think I found my room! Well, what do you think? It's perfect, Ethan. We'll be able to forget what happened. We'll lead a normal life. And one day, it'll all just seem like a bad dream. We've earned the right to be happy now, Ethan. All three of us. today is on the cover of today's world magazine this week and has been hailed by the whole nation as a new hero for our times astonishingly he almost single-handedly ended the sinister series of killings by the man known as the origami killer and saved the life of young sean mars his determination courage and intelligence have won our admiration norman jaden <laughs>
You killed my son, Scott. Were you thinking about that when you held me in your arms? I don't know why you did all this. Nothing can justify it anyway. I feel nothing but contempt for you. Nothing but contempt. 